Morning, a uh, warning to look out for those cicadas. Experts say you'll likely see or see and most certainly hear them any day now. We have a news reporter Allison Williams live in Richmond this morning. So Allison, what's the latest on these bugs? Well, Autumn and Delaney, I can't lie. I have Autumn, your story about the margarita snake falling from the ceiling on my mind this morning. I'm right under a branch and I'm horrified a cicada is going to fall on my head. Now we'll start seeing them because of the warm temperatures we've been experiencing. Once the ground turns 64 degrees, they'll start emerging up and we'll see their exoskeletons all around. That's kind of how you'll know that they're here. Now these brood 14s emerge from the ground every 17 years. In fact, the last time Central Virginia saw these was back in 2008. Adult cicadas do not feed, so most of your plants should be in the clear. However, female cicadas can damage young trees while laying eggs, but most can easily be protected with some netting. Now, these cicadas are loud, so while you're outside for the next few weeks, take in the sound of the cicadas because it could be another 17 years until you hear the brood 14s again. Understand that they're not hazardous. Uh, I would say, you know, the big thing is enjoy the symphony that we're going to hear from all of these millions of bugs because they're going to be very distinct from the rest of the cicadas. These cicadas, the males will give off a screaming sound and the, the females will give off a sound like a flicker. Ah, uh, yes, the screaming sound of cicadas. Now, these, again, are not hazardous. They don't bite, they don't sting. So humans and pets are safe, and they'll only be around for about five to six weeks. So experts say there is no reason to use pesticides. Live in Richmond, Allison Williams, 8 News. <laughs>